It's there. Really? Yeah. That's where it was found? Yeah, it is yeah, there. Just here? Yeah. Mm. Just there? Yeah. It is there. Is it back? Hey. Well, this is it. This is the place. Because this is where the earliest human remains in the entire world were discovered. It's been really difficult to find it. It's taken us four hours to walk here, and we've been a circuitous route through the bush. And it seems really strange that there's nothing to mark it, because this is such an important place in our story. And it's as close as I can get to where we all began. Amazing. And this is what the archaeologists discovered. This is a cast of the skull that was found here and which was dated to 195,000 years ago. I think, considering it's so old, it's remarkably complete. OK, the fragile face bones are missing, but most of the brain cases here, we can see the size of the brain and we can see this very characteristic forehead. No other remains of our species, even approaching this age, have been found anywhere else on the planet. This is as near as we can get to the origin of our species. There's something very special about sitting here, looking out at the Omo. I could be on the banks of any African river. Apart from the fact we know that this landscape has been home to humans, people like you and me, for nearly 200,000 years. So if this is where we first appeared, what did we come from? The evidence suggests that the very first human-like creatures evolved in Africa over four million years ago. They were much more ape-like than us. A series of human species with gradually bigger brains came and went. The most recent and only surviving is our own species, Homo sapiens, modern humans.